Wow. Hello guys, Fishing Chef here and today um, there is going to be a low tide at 9.06. It is now about 9.30, 9.40. Um, yeah, I'm going to go for rock crab and then rockfish if I get lucky. So yeah, let's uh, let's get it started. I think this is a good hole. It's deep enough. Oh, small, small baby uh, cow greenly. Oh. oh, not cow greenly. It's a uh, rockfish. It's too small. <laughs> okay, take the picture first. <laughs> I think this is a grass. Whoa. <laughs> if it's bigger, I will keep it, but it's too small. You don't want it? Oh, there it goes. It's fine. <laughs> Oh, I lost it. Dang. There was a fish. I missed it. Gonna stop the poke pulling and doing some crapping right now. Sure. <laughs> this is a wrong setup for crabbing. It's way too light. Oh, sure. No. Are there no crabs around here? I'm gonna have to come up. <laughs> Alright, that should be enough. That should be enough seaweed. Sun is out. Let's see if I get a crab now. Alrighty, I got one finally. Look at this. Oh wow, it's a good size. Cool. Let's let's get a measure on this guy. Yeah, it's about five and a half. That's good. Harvest of the day, and I take these home and cook them up. First, prepare the rice. Limpets and the seaweeds, I'm gonna blanch them. Seaweeds. And the limpets, because I don't want the guts. So I'm gonna... See, once you cook the limpet, it came off the shell, and then the gut is behind it, and you can just cut that off. Go ahead and put this into the rice soup. A little salt. So you don't want to have the rice stick to the bottom. So you have to stir the pot from time to time. Put the lid back on. And I'm gonna prepare the crab. Okay. 
Um, here's the gut in the crab that you want to get rid of, that you don't want to eat in the shell. Put the gut in the middle and then the rest is edible. It's too big. Turn it over. So aromatic. Ooh. -hoo. in the next episode. Bye-bye now.